Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> so we're carrying on with the Simplicity series today. If you're new here, my name is Wendy Tomlinson. I'm your life and business coach here on YouTube. So as part of the Simplicity series today, I wanted to just quickly cover meal planning because this is an area where you can really, really simplify things. So there are just a few things that I want to share. First of all, I recommend planning your meal. So I just use a simple planner like this. This is so cheap. If you live here in um, England, I got this from Wilco's. Um, it, it was something like a pound. It was really cheap. So it doesn't really matter. You can just use a sort of like a sheet of paper and just write the days of the week down. And what I tend to do is I tend to just focus on the evening meals because, you know, our breakfast is... You know, pretty simple. It's pretty, it's pretty much the same thing most days. We have sort of like three or four um, things that we can sort of like choose from, and the same for me for lunches because I'm here on my own at lunchtime, and things are pretty simple. It's usually like soup, salad, um, you know, a sandwich, something like that, something on toast. So it's really my evening meals that I focus on with my planner, and what works for me rather than saying on a Monday. Um, this is the meal we're having on a Tuesday, this is the meal. What I tend to do is I tend to just write down enough meals to cover the week. So although my planner at the moment says Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I just write the meals down and then as I choose that meal for that particular day, I'll just cross that off. So even though it says sort of like uh, maybe spaghetti bolognese on Monday, we might not have that till Thursday. And that works better for me than having sort of like the rigid, um, this sort of having on Monday, this sort of having on Tuesday. Now, another thing, if, um, if things are a little bit sort of like chaotic, sometimes what I do is I go to a, so like it's an old fashioned thing, you know, like it, I think sort of years and years ago, it always used to be, I have fish on Friday. And, you know, that's actually quite a simple way of doing it. So, you know, on a Monday, you could just do, um, Monday is a chicken night, Tuesday is pork, Wednesday is, um, you know, um, a meat-free day. So you could do it like that. That's another way of doing it. And I do that sometimes. Um, I'm, I'm not a big fan of cooking at the best of times. I, I cook because I have to, to feed my family. But um, that's another way of doing it as well, to sort of simplify things. So also, I recommend so like you have a routine with your meal planning. So pick a day and, you know, go through your cupboards, go through your fridge, go through your freezer, check what you've got, make your meal plan and then make your list for shopping so that you're shopping once rather than, you know, going three or four times. Um, I personally like online grocery shopping. I just find that that cuts out way more time because I don't have to then take time out of my day. I can order my delivery on like a Sunday evening when, you know, I'm not particularly doing anything else and it's not taking time out of my business life or you know, the time where I enjoy, I'm enjoying time with other people. So that is something you can do. Um, what else do I want to share with you about meal, simplifying meals? Another thing that I want to share with you, and this is sort of like my, my final sort of like tip, is that you don't have to cook gourmet meals every night. So Yes, there are certain things that we need to make sure that we're having. We need to make sure we're having plenty of fruit, plenty of vegetables, protein, you know, good carbohydrates, things like that. But that doesn't have to mean that you're in the kitchen making like really fancy meals every night. So what I want you to do is to just look at ways you can simplify meal times you know what can you do because this isn't just this series isn't really about me so I like say you know you have to do this you must do this it's more about getting you thinking about what you can do in your life because your life's going to be completely different to mine so you know just keep asking what can I do to simplify this area of my life Okay, so that's my tip for today and I will see you tomorrow with some more on the Simplicity Series. Bye.